morning, Raj. How are you doing? Good morning. I'm doing great. Thank good. you for asking. And how are you? I'm pretty good. Doing well. Morning times are always good, so it's good. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So, um, Raj, today's topic is very interesting, and uh, it speaks about let's go party tonight. Yeah. Yeah. Have you gone through it? Yeah. Yes? Yes. Okay. Yeah. Great. So before that, uh, there are two topics. That is uh, extempore topics. Uh, extempore topics. That is uh, how to annoy the passenger next to you on a flight. Or right. dessert should always be served before dinner. So what do you feel? Which one is uh, which one is more you know appropriate, and which one do you, do you want to speak about? Ah, uh, both. I mean, if I talk about the passenger. Uh, the only thing that i can do is to avoid someone like uh, i have experienced of going i mean traveling through train and uh, like in trains generally passengers talk a lot uh, in respect to their uh, flight that i have not experienced but i have listened it mm -hmm. i mean listen to it that uh, on flights generally people are served so much things that they are busy in themselves reading right. comics and all that so they hardly uh, feel that urge to talk with others right but on trains people generally indulge in talking and they talk about various topics they start uh, with their personal life experience and then they go on talking about politics and whatever happening in society in uh, the whatever politicians are doing the police are doing and everything like they touch every aspect of life so in those situations, if you are listening to them and mm -hmm. if you are just admitting that, yes, you are right, this should be not be done and all, they would enjoy it. But right. once you start avoiding, even if you are, I mean, arguing, it's good. But if you start avoiding them, it becomes irritating for them. It's like if you are completely ignoring. Yes, so, right. If you want to uh, that is the one thing. Yeah. That is the one thing I have experienced and I have done um, most of time because uh, sometimes I feel like if I'm able to enjoy whatever they are talking, it's good. But if I'm unable to, then mm -hmm. I would uh, just simply avoid them and uh, look to my mobile or something. Or if I have a book with me, I will start reading that. Okay. So these things so, so can be, be done to, uh, yeah. to be out of the conversation, you start reading. Yeah. Okay. But still, if they're talking loudly, what would you do? Oh, uh, in, in fact, in that case, I am unable to read something. But uh, of course, listening to music, the one thing that I do, I, I'll listen to music and uh, just ignore them. Ignore it. Okay. So yeah. if you have a, now the question was how to annoy the passenger next to you. So if you have to annoy the passenger, how would you do that? Okay. <laughs> have you ever like, done with anybody? I don't think so. But uh, just like that, if somebody is trying to talk uh, and they have started talking and then you are ignoring them, so it's also like annoying. Annoying them, of yes. course. So okay. uh, that is the only way I have done it. Right, right. So any funny incident you have, uh, you know, experienced in the train journey? Uh, so many times, like uh, uh, the way I said that they start talking with on different topics. So mm -hmm. they talk uh, and they uh, share their ideas. Sometimes they are very funny as well. Right. Uh, and uh, like uh, one incident uh, with one of my friends. So generally what happens uh, in slippers, we get uh, so much crowd. Yes, right. So uh, it was crowded that day. And uh, he said that there are so many unwanted people on on mm -hmm. this bogey and yeah. something like that. Yeah. And uh, a girl got annoyed. She uh, got in argument with him. And uh, like that was the time they uh, she started speaking that how dare you say that? How can anybody be unwanted and all that? So, so they had so, uh, there was a yeah. They had an argument and first, I mean, for maybe five or 10 minutes. And then after 
uh, things got normal and they started talking on different topics as well. Okay. They, I mean, by the end, they became almost like friends. Friends. And there, yeah. there are many times when you start exchanging numbers and then you become long-term friends with people who are actually strangers and you met them in the train, right? Yeah. Yeah. So do you have any friend like that? On the train journey uh, or some other journey? Yeah, I, I have, of course. And even in that case, like uh, uh, the other person had shared his number with me and uh, way, way back, even, I mean, a decade ago, maybe 2011 or 12. Okay, so, that's a long time now. You're still yeah, in touch. Time. <laughs> yeah, I had been in touch with him for only for one year after that incident and then I lost the number of mobile as well. Okay, okay. So, um, a train journeys are always special and there are many poems and uh, if you go to see a lot of songs also build up on that. So, uh, yeah. yes, there will be more things maybe we can recall from our train journeys. Uh, let's go to the next topic now. So, dessert should always be served before dinner. You feel about it? Just in short, maybe. Yeah, it's like one answer. No, no dessert should always be served after the dinner, after, after okay. the meal. Yes, and why so? Uh, because we enjoy eating that way, like mm -hmm. uh, like that uh, ad says, which meetha ho jai after the meal. <laughs> after the meal, right, right. So, do you think that we are in a habit, Raj, that we keep, uh, you know, eating the dessert? We, you know, because we have been eating like that, so we don't want to change that pattern, and we are not ready to do that. Maybe you know, if we involve one sweet, and then later maybe you know the dinner. So we consume less dinner that time. It, is it possible? What do you feel about it? Yeah, of course. Like if we have, uh, it, it's about me. I can say about myself that if I have dessert uh, first before the meal, I would not be able to eat properly. properly. So it's always better to have it later. Later. Yes, right, right. So nowadays people, a lot of people, if they are visiting um, weddings or any other buffets, so what they do is they prefer to eat the starters and the dessert and they don't they just skip the main meal because that becomes too heavy on the palate yeah yeah of so uh, yes so i think that for, for me like according to me I, I would say that it doesn't matter if you like it just eat it yeah, yeah. right okay so now the next uh, there are two be, uh, idioms uh, raj uh, shared beating around the bush and be in a tight corner Right. Okay. So beating around so, the bush is commonly used. Uh, yeah, of course. I like if somebody is not serious about uh, uh, if somebody is not serious about his target or some anything else, huh? and if they are in uh, discussion with someone and they are beating around the bush, uh, they might uh, be in a tight corner. Yes. Right. They can be in a tight one. Yes, correct. So now uh, we are talking about the parties, Raj. Okay. The parties can be huge part of your social life. Do you enjoy meeting new people at a uh, party? Uh, I'm not good at that. Okay. So when you have of to course. socialize, do you, social, you, do you actually go for parties? Yeah, of course. I do go uh, to uh, family, relatives and all. They generally all those uh, family gatherings or even the friends gathering. Okay, okay. So you go for family gatherings, right? Yeah. Okay. Uh, and uh, when there are new people in the parties, Raj, do you go and actually uh, take an initiative to go and talk to them? Yeah, that's what, and that's what I was about to uh, tell her, that I'm not good at that. And if somebody comes to me, uh, it's okay, I... First, to start talking, like sharing uh, our whereabouts and all. Okay. And then, of course, if it is initiated from their side and what, whichever topic they start, I dive into that and start enjoying. But I am unable to start it on my own okay. or to initiate from my side. Right. So, to, to initiate a topic, it becomes difficult, you said. Uh, you mean, yeah. You Okay, so um, uh, if you could self-invite yourself 
to any party in the world across time which party would you want to attend self invite yeah if, so if you have yeah. to if you get a chance to self invite yourself in a party across the world okay so which party would you invite yourself to uh maybe uh, a big mega party where the singers are there and they are about to perform okay yeah so the, yeah so because singers of course my favorite singers like sonu nigam or shreya goshal alkam ma'am and all of them okay so you will self invite in those parties where they are present <laughs> yeah okay fine great so what is your definition of a party ah uh, a party can be of different type it's a it doesn't require only to be in the gatherings only even if two or three people are there they can enjoy like a party and it's all about enjoyment the yes. way you want to enjoy it, just enjoy it your way right right so um, you are you according to you that two to three people are also okay if if there's a party and they are enjoying and thoroughly being with each other that's also yeah. Party, right yeah of course like uh, uh, sometimes uh, friends we have i mean some close friends if they are having a, a birthday party right so generally i i do not have that group i mean when whenever we enjoy we are always 10 or 12 person but yes. some people can enjoy even if they are two or three uh, i mean three or four people and then three is okay right 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 so um, when you are in a whole group where do you usually go to party like with your friends you said 12 people so where do you usually go ah uh, anywhere like uh, restaurant or any other tourist place mm -hmm. so we enjoy that way yes 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 so you you recently also told me that you're traveling somewhere else with your friends right uh, you're planning right for the coming year ah uh, like uh, in september yeah right odisha odisha you were planning right or you have already been yeah. there no no in maybe in last week or okay. uh, last week of december we are going there and yes. we have already covered one in september that was uttarakhand uttarakhand yes you mentioned that before okay so um which party would you want to attend which you already have told me the party where all the musicians will be there and why would you wish to go to specific party so what would you do over there if you're going and meeting the musicians especially you now you see all your favorite singers out there so what would you do would, would you take the initiative to go and meet them of course like i said uh, first thing that they are going to perform so right from the kumar sanu and nodit nayan all the favorite singers of 90s or even yes. before that if they are they are someone so first thing i would uh, go to them greet them like i show my gratitude to yes. them that uh, i am a big fan of yours and i have been grown up listening to you and all that mm -hmm. and i would enjoy their performance okay so uh, you will definitely and i would also share i uh, like to my wish that i i mean as a day dreamer i used to wish that i would get a chance to learn from you and something like that okay fine so that that and that will be such a nice experience right meeting your idols and role models and then you go and meet them and you tell them that how do you feel about it yeah okay so raj uh, if given a chance you can go back to the parties which you have attended from your childhood okay do you want to live any relive any party and you remember it very clearly that uh, you had so much of fun that right uh i i don't remember any but of course if i would be given a chance i would go like i have always explained that i was a bit a pessimist yeah. so there are so many parties where i did not enjoy properly i okay. was uh, present there only because of my obligation to be present right so right. i would like to change that hmm. so uh, that was that big uh, like you know your or you can say that how many years back uh maybe a few parties in last 5 uh, years last 5 years okay 
So are there certain people and events that you avoid at all the cost? Um, no, I, I don't feel that. I mean, I don't feel the urge to avoid anyone. It's like, okay. uh, if uh, I mean, I if I'm busy with myself, it's certainly that nobody comes to me. But if uh, I need, I mean, I have not never thought that way. And why would I avoid anybody? Uh, nobody, yeah, nobody is that irritating to me. Okay. In which country would this party be? So, if if you want to go for a any, if you want to go to any other country to party, do you have any other country in mind where you want to party? Ah, uh, no matter the place, I already told you where the part and uh, the people about the people. Yeah. So wherever no. they are together, I I won't mind. I okay. I mean the place hardly matters. Okay. So have you planned any parties like house parties or birthday parties? For yourself, Ebo? Uh, I have not planned it. You have never planned it? No. Okay. Like even on my birthday, my friends plan. Sometimes I tend to avoid, but most of the time I give in uh, to their insistence and enjoy with them. Yes, right. So are you a person on your birthdays, Raj, that you get very happy that, you know, now everybody is going to come, meet, they are going to celebrate? Or are you a person who is like, okay, I have to pick up all the calls and say thank you? Uh, I'm the latter one. <laughs> so I think even I'm the same with you because that's <laughs> something which I can't relate, relate with. Like, why to call so many times? I don't want to pick up the calls. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So, um. Okay, so in which country uh, we have already spoken about it? Do you have you ever hosted any party? Ah, uh, no, like no. the one the birthday ones, which uh, which we generally enjoy. Like it's not that I host; it's about the group. So I I won't say that. Okay, so um, you just hosted within the film. Yeah. Okay. And how was the experience hosting a party? Uh, like I explained it, that I give in to their demand. So, of course, at the end, I enjoy. But uh, if it is my birthday, I I don't think uh, there is a... I mean, I'm not that excited. But if in case the other's birthday, I enjoy it. Because they are happy, they are ready to enjoy. So, uh, yes. I think that way. But... Uh, on my birthday, I generally think that if I'm alone, I mean, there is no, it's just like another day. Why mm -hmm. to make a big deal of it? So okay. I fall in that category. Okay. So uh, would this be, a part, would this party be celebrating something specific or would this be a simple gathering of friends? So if you are planning, you said that, you know, you're planning small parties or if your birthday party is happening. So would you like to have a small gathering or a bigger gathering? You already have 12 uh, friends. It's a bigger gathering already. <laughs> of course, of course. So, so uh, yeah. Uh, yes, tell I me. mean, of course, it would be a, a small gathering. Uh, okay, so I think it's all about your parties and everything. So, have you been to a theme party? Mm, theme party? Uh, no. Theme. No, no, never. Theme, theme party, okay. Party. No, I have never been. Okay, and how about a Halloween party? Ah, I have not been in Halloween party as well. But you have seen it, right? How it goes and how it works out and how people dress up. Ah, uh, yes, I have uh, heard about it. Okay, so if you have to choose a character to become for a Halloween, do you have something in your mind? Ah. Uh, Maybe like a ghost. Uh, like a ghost. Okay. Yeah. And if you have to plan a theme party, what theme it would be on? Hmm. A theme party. Maybe I would. Uh, I would host it on any Goa beach. Okay, at the Goa beach. At, yeah, Goa at beach. the at the beach of Goa. Okay. Okay. So that's uh, that's. Have you been to Goa before? Oh, uh, no. Okay. Never. I would love to visit Goa. Maybe that is in our bucket list. Like the way we have started yes. covering 
<coughs> so we have started it from North India. Yes, and right. uh, Goa is in our bucket list. Bucket list. Okay, great. So, um, what do you mean by the word tedious? Sorry. Do you have uh, like what do you mean by the word tedious? T yeah. Tedious uh, is almost like boring. Yes, uh, of yeah, course, boring. Uh, boring or insipid. Okay, so can you just quickly think about a sentence on tedious? Yeah. Like uh, sometimes I behave in a tedious manner, which is not good, and of course I should not do that. Okay, okay, that's good. Uh, good answer. And bountiful. And bountiful is again uh, someone who uh, serves others well. Yes, very so well. So I can say that I think of being a bountiful. And uh, but I have not been one till now because of certain reasons. And to be straightforward, of course, the financial reason. Mm -hmm. So you started. You said I think of becoming a bountiful person, right? Yeah. 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 Okay. So uh, yes, very well answered. Now uh, just one or two more. We'll take it and we'll move ahead to the other topic. So uh, what about surpass? Surpass, S-U-R. Surpass. Yeah. Yeah. Surpass. It's like something uh, has uh, done. Something has been passed by or something like that. Yeah. So to do it or be better than surpass. Yeah. Right. You want to try one sentence on surpass? Like uh, even in the first year of college, people were expecting that he will surpass Sachin Tendulkar. Lovely, lovely, very good. So you, I like the way you are, you know, you don't think too much. You just try to put the word in the sentence and deliver it. So good yeah. job, there. good job there. But when we are communicating, these words are, you know, you not use more often. Like what I yeah. saw, the general conversation yeah, yeah. was a very basic conversation about parties. I know it was not your area of interest today, but uh, <laughs> I could just relate it, you know, I could just understand from your face. So, uh, yes, um, it's okay. It happens sometimes. Sometimes the topic comes like that, that you have to be there and answer, right? Just like parties when some some person is coming to you and talking to you and you just have to answer for the sake of it, right? So, like, uh, uh, we were talking about the parties and I would say, I mean, uh, the party that I was talking about, they were uh, singers would be. So if I have to host a party like that, I would like to host and I would like to invite invite them. Yes. Uh, even if they are not ready to perform, it's good. They would be invited and others would perform. And in that party, I would like to invite to some of my favorites, a speaker partner from Clappingo. Oh, <laughs> some, of, some of my other virtual friends along with my friends and relatives and of course because music is the thing that everybody enjoys yes definitely so of course they would enjoy them as well right right and where would be the location ah location would be in india only anywhere okay. so choose uh, the spot where, where wherever they would they would agree to come if it, it is in delhi or mumbai or any other place okay so uh, maybe somewhere somewhere closer to a, like a historic place or maybe closer to the nature, right? Yeah. Yeah. So basically, I feel that, you know, there there was a time when you want to go and party. Have you been to a club? Uh, no. No. Okay. So there, there, you know, there is a time when you start enjoying clubbing and things like that. But when you start growing up, you are more into, you know, you want to party and become, you know, stay at home and, uh, <laughs> yeah. you know, so that's what uh, we tend to do. So, uh, you know, this, this, uh, like, I'm just sharing my bit. So uh, this weekend we were planning to have a party and I was like, no, not outside. Let's do it at a house. Like, you know, let's do a house party. And like, uh, then they were like, Ankita, you, how come you have become like that? You know, so you change over the time, like, you know, and over the years, you don't want to go out. You want to be in your comfort zone and party, like, you know, at your house and be with your friends and talk and have a conversation. Yeah, of course. I, I, I mean, I like that way only. Uh, right. Whenever people, I mean, my, uh, the group of my friends, 
they think about a party. I, I say that they have it at somebody's home only. Don't right. go to restaurant or other places. I, yeah, I think it's because of the comfort zone we have been in. So now it's it's very it's very awkward to come out of it, right? Because at home we are free to enjoy together. Like uh, yeah, yeah, right. if you are going to a restaurant and uh, celebrating a cake cutting ceremony there, there would be other person as well. Right. And uh, I mean you cannot book the whole restaurant for True. one hour or something like that. So, but at your home, you are free to enjoy. Yes, you have a time refrain like when you go out. Yeah. Okay. So, Raj, do you have anything else to uh, share or uh, clarify or talk? Oh, once again, I missed. I had written, but I think I'll take more than one minute to find it where okay. I had written this. We will always, yeah, it's, it's uh, two minutes we have. So, just in case you remember, let me know, or, or else definitely in the next class, you can ask me initially only, like, you know, when the session starts. Mm. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, so how was the, uh, how was the day planned today, Raj? Uh, I had just woke up, so I have no planning at all. Okay. I mean, uh, like uh, I woke up uh, in the midnight around 1.30 and then I started reading a book. And then I fall asleep again around 3 or 3.30 and then I woke up just uh, 5 or 7 minutes to this Between session. This session. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so now after the session, you will plan your day, what has to be done. Yeah. Okay, great, great. So Raj, uh, we will, uh, then I'll take a leave today and uh, I'll meet you soon, very soon again. And uh, Yeah, of course. I like day after tomorrow, we have one. Oh, great, online. great. So I, yes, I look forward to meet you again. Then until then, have fun and enjoy your day. Yeah, same, same to you. Enjoy your day, have a nice day. And uh, we'll see you soon. Sure.